Hi guys, my name is Sir Azli. So for today, we will learn on English subjects. So I am feel very excited and just honored to share you guys with my topic present continuous tense. Let's go. Okay, present continuous tense. Present continuous tense. Okay, the first one. What is present continuous tense? Present continuous tense is things happening now. Okay, which is happening now. Dia sedang berlaku. Okay. The second one is happen over a period of time. The third one is in the near future. Happen over a period maksudnya sedang berlaku dalam sesuatu tempo and the, in the near future dalam masa terdekat ataupun masa hadapan. So as a conclusion, I can share with you guys a present continuous tense present come out in a best form. So bila best form, we know that dia mesti come out dengan verbs. Okay, anything present present tense. Contoh kita tengok perkataan work, eat, jam. Ini adalah best form. The one kita panggil sebagai verb. Work, makan. Eat, a work, bekerja. Eat, makan, jam, melompat. The one kita tahu since kita berada pada lower form until upper form benda ni kita dah tahu lahir lahir benda tu dah ada. The one kita panggil present. Tense or simple present tense. Okay, the second task is present continuous tense. Okay, what is continuous? Continuous adalah it's match to the happen over a period of time. Dalam sesuatu uh, situation, benda tu berlaku dalam satu tempo which is with plus ing. Okay, so become verb present work. Eat, jump, become plus ing akan jadi working, eating and jumping. Okay, you got what I mean? So present continuous tense, combination dia happening now, happen over a period of time and in the near future dalam masa depan. But don't get confused dengan simple future tense. But fu simple future tense kita eat, kita add will and shall but for present continuous tense kena ingat present adalah base form kita tak ubah dia menjadi regular verb or irregular verb dalam past tense dia work eat jump then kita ada uh, run become continuous plus ing mudah it's easy for you kita plus ing sahaja so ini adalah three, uh, three things ni adalah uh, refer to the what is present continu continuous tense okay alright next one How to use PCT or I call as a present continuous tense. Okay, so when the subject is singular, singular maksudnya satu. Okay, singular. Bila singular satu kita kena guna verb to be is. Okay, verb to be is. When the subject is plural with more than one kita guna are. Alright, so kita pergi pada verb to be. So there are five verb to be. The first one is A, was, were, am. Okay, so is kita memang tahu dia untuk singular. A for plural, was for singular, were for plural, and am for plural. Don't get confused because a lot of student akan ingat am is for singular. Meanwhile, am is for plural because what? Special case I and you dalam hukum English is plural bukan singular. Okay, because what? Dalam Cambridge, uh, uh, Ali, Sarah, okay, he, she consider as a singular. Meanwhile, meanwhile, they, them, they are plural. Kita tahu ini ramai. But special case for I and you, saya, awak, awak, saya plural. So, bila plural, am mesti plural. I am a boy, I am a girl. Okay. So, is kita gunakan singular, a plural, was singular, were plural, am plural. Okay. So, same goes to this. When the subject is singular, kita guna is. Nampak? When the subject is plural, a. Tapi now, kita bercakap, we're talking about present continuous. Kalau saya tukar, I change to the, to the past continuous become when the subject is singular, past eh, past continuous akan jadi Singular was plus ing plural were plus ing. But now kita bagi uh, kita bagi uh, uh, I'm talking about present continuous. Become is and are past was and were. Okay, so 
When the subject is singular, contoh, my school is having a 3R campaign this week. So this week ini refer kepada period of time, over period of time dan satu tempo. Alright. So sekarang ni, macam mana kita nak detect or identify kenal pasti this one is a present continuous tense, PCT. Alright. So is is refer to the present. Okay, that one is singular. Having ing continuous. Okay, as I talked you before tadi, right? So when the subject is plural, kita tengok verb to be ah. We are having an exam next week. Next week ini refer pada how happen over a period of time dalam sesuatu tempo, right? So we ini refer pada plural, alright? Ah plural having with ing continuous. Okay, alright. Next one. Okay. Things How to use PCT And the last one is The comparison and differences Between present tense And present continuous tense Right So uh, Bila dalam of uh, lower form okey kita dah didedahkan dengan what is present tense kita tahu ada uh, what is present tense present tense berlaku sekarang it's not a future tense bukan past tense so benda tu like i uh, like, like i told you just now work it jam run the one is present tense so what is present tense present tense adalah to show fixed habit or routine okey so dia menunjukkan what is fixed habit tabiat yang tetap and Uh, tabiat yang uh, fixed habit dan rutin uh, Rutin atau tabiat yang tetap We can't change Kita tak akan boleh ubah Meanwhile For PCT Ini adalah benda yang baru It's not baru Tapi normally kita akan belajar dekat upper form PCT is to show action are happening At the present moment But will finish soon So benda ni Okay To show action are happening at the present moment Dia akan terjadi dalam present moment Tapi dia akan habis Finish soon Different Okay Differences dia Benda ni tetap Dia tak boleh ubah Tapi benda ni akan Boleh berubah Okay The differences and comparison Between present tense And present continuous tense Okay So as, as I talk you just now So present tense ini tadi Menunjukkan to show fixed habit So bila fixed habit Benda tu tetap Kita takkan boleh ubah Contoh I come out dengan satu Sentences yang very simple one Okay Rosie Plays Tennis Okay That one is present tense Kita tahu Rosie akan play tennis Sebab itu fix Tak akan berubah Kita tahu dia akan play tennis Now Rosie is a singular subject So saya tambah S Okay Plays Meanwhile Kalau saya tukar they Plays Akan jadi without S Okay Sebab Rosie seorang Plays put S That one verb lah Kalau they Bahkan jadi Play ni without S So sekarang ni For ex for an example Present tense Rosie plays tennis Okay Ini menunjukkan fixed habit Routine Okay Dia tak akan berubah Meanwhile For present continuous tense PCT That one yang saya nak highlightkan For today is Are happening at the present moment But will finish soon So become Rosie Is Playing Tennis Okay We can see Present Which one present? Present menunjukkan Is Verb to be is Singular Continuous ING Okay So Apa beza dia? Rosie plays tennis Rosie is playing tennis The first one Present tense Present continuous tense So Rosie play tennis Fix Fix habit Benda tu akan tetap But Rosie is playing tennis Okay uh, It's uh, Action are happening At the present moment But dia akan habis Finish soon Okay Sebab because we know that Benda ni tak, benda ni tak akan tetap Dia akan finish soon Alright Thank you so much That's all for today For today From now You may know How to Make the differences And comparison between Present tense And present Continuous tense In applying In essay writing Either in section A Or section B Directed Or continuous one uh, Present And present continuous tense More important in narrative or descriptive essay So guys, that's all for today I really hope that you got something from my lesson today And don't forget to subscribe our channel in YouTube Intuition, thank you